At the end of the, you know, the last fixture against West Brom here, and they must have had the tails between their legs. Psychologically, maybe it was, uh, maybe added over us a little bit, Alan, um, and the staff and the players there. But you know, to be uh, to be fair, they've come out with their, you know, with their teeth showing today, and uh, he knew he was going to be in for a, a tough game as well. It seemed to me that. Um, we, we really do deserve to pat ourselves on the back a little bit because for the first 45 minutes, really, West Brom never got to the ball first and we didn't allow them to get to the ball first. We made a point of getting everything and trying to dictate the game. We did, and uh, I'm still reluctant to pat everybody on the back because we uh, we're not even up to Christmas yet. Mm. We've got a few weeks yet to go to Christmas. Um, but it's, it's probably beyond everybody's expectations, the position we're in at the moment. But... You know, when you've been in the game as long as uh, you know, as I have, or Brian has, or indeed some of the uh, the senior players, you know, not to count your chickens before they're hatched. And I, you know, my my, my part words in the dressing room today were uh, there's certainly more downs than ups in this game. And uh, when you do get your little ups like like uh, like we've got today, go and enjoy it because they don't last for very long. I mean, we've got another game coming up on Tuesday night, Sheffield United. You know, we could well be. Uh, you know, sulking, you know, in, in the space of, what, 48 hours, 72 hours. We've got to make sure that we enjoy this and, and maybe go into the same game with the same frame of mind on Tuesday night. And again, I'll say now, you know, nil-nil will do me there. Mm. Well, let's hope that it does continue. Uh, we'll try and get our voices back anyway for, for Tuesday night and uh, certainly for next Saturday, because, of course, Tranmere next Saturday as well. Oh, it'll be lovely. Well, they're coming thick and fast. <laughs> you know, Stoke, uh, Ipswich, Barnsley, you know, West Bromwich Albion, Sheffield United, Tranmere... You know, they're coming really thick and fast and you know, I'm sure the players enjoy it mm. and they're relishing every game as they come up now. Well, I think the fans are as well by the sounds of things today. There's a lot of people enjoyed themselves and uh, thanks Kenny Swain and let's hope it continues. My pleasure. Forrester. Giles. Forrester. Oh, good, great ball, Giles. No power in the shots. Good cover there, though, by Alan Kelly. Oh.